bed bugs are like an STI you can give your parents' couch, and Montreal is totally infested with them. My apartment building is infested with them. My apartment was, too. I just spoke to my landlord about it, and he hired an exterminator. After two, uh, now three sprayings, my apartment just smells like musty pesticide, but I was still seeing these fairly large brown blood-sucking insects just about everywhere. What is keeping me safe from these now, though, is what's called the good night bed. I had this bed delivered to my apartment, I threw out my old one, and I built this one in about an hour. There are a few special things to know about the good night. One, it was designed by entomologists who know a lot about bed bugs. They know how bed bugs get into beds, they know what draws them to a bed, and they know how to kill bed bugs the safest and cleanest way possible. The second thing to know about the good night is that it is built to keep bed bugs out. In my bed, there are only six distinct ways for bugs to even get to the mattress holding part of the bed. Six rods separate the frame of the bed from the mattress, and bed bugs have an impossibly hard time climbing the rods. Uh, they aren't good climbers, as it turns out. What's more, around each of these rods is placed a sticky trap. The bed came with quite a few of these traps, and they're very easy to install, as you can see from the video. But they still aren't the most interesting aspect of the good night bed. This is one bed bug that tried to get into the bed. Uh, using the sticky traps that come included with the bed, uh, this little thing was caught, and now it's looking a little bit crispy. That's because the third and most unique aspect of the good night bed is the way it kills bed bugs. You unfold this built-in heat shield, zip it closed, and crank the dial up to three hours. The bed heats up, everything within the envelope over three hours, purifying uh, sheets, mattress pillows, and anything else you feel like tossing in there at the same time. I use it to treat my clothing, shoes, and books uh, without any damage to any of them. It's pretty great. It, the bed never gets hot enough to cause damage to these objects, just hot enough to kill a bug. They die at around 50 degrees Celsius, and mostly can't last more than a few minutes. Uh, cranking the dial on the bed to three hours is to ensure that the heat penetrates the deepest levels of the mattress, toasting any bugs or eggs that you might find uh, living deep within the recesses of your mattress or uh, box spring. It is not an exaggeration to say that the good night bed has rescued my sanity. I was missing a lot of sleep, and when I got this bed, uh, I just felt really safe. <laughs> uh, I felt like I was living on a, an island in this roiling sea of blood-sucking insects, and they could not get ashore. So I'm making this video uh, to thank the good night bed team, because I think they made a really cool product, and to let the people know, and especially other Montrealers know, that there is uh, a really interesting economical and ecological solution to their bed bug problems. So thank you very much for watching and have a good night.